Hello dudes, it's me Alana standing here back with another Windcraft quest guide. Today we are taking a look at a grave mistake. It's a combat level minimum of 50, it's a medium length quest. Stay away from those coordinates. We're going to start off by right clicking to track it. This quest requires you to have completed uh, the House of Twain quest, uh, level 49 one. Um, but yeah, we're starting outside the back of Nessak here and we're going to make our way sort of to the Twain Mansion. Uh, so we're going to follow the southern road here. And we're going to go past the old fisherman dude over here. And continue uh, along the southern path here. And over at this intersection, we're going to Go to the left and continue on the southern path. And here we are, we pass the bridge here and we continue to the back of the House of Twain. And over here we find alum you might want to leave there's nothing in this graveyard this place is private and she click to start the quest and of course we're not going to do what he says we're going to enter i have warned you so there are four things we need to do so we're going to start off by going to this church here enter it here through graveyard and here's the entrance we go gonna go through here gonna head to uh, the stairs here and go down to the right continue through here and uh, we enter this room here with the lava it's gonna do these particles here so we turn around and this uh, sort of statue moves and we enter through and then we just go through the door here and we can see this monstrosity Once there was a man, one out of four. There we are, so now we just spawn randomly in the graveyard here. Gonna head back onto the main path here. And now we're gonna do uh, one of the uh, three remaining things. There's one in each house here. We're gonna start off with this house right here. We're gonna enter it. And right over here, at the uh, door to the left here, uh, not that room, but this one. This dude falls here, he dies, and he drops an abandoned key. Go back here to the first door, drop it in, enter, go up the stairs, go through here, over to this opening over here with all these windows. Key should spawn over here. Let's see, there we are. An attic key here. Then we go back down here, go up here, climb the ladder. Here's the attic. Drop the key and enter. Go to the back, and we turn around and jump scare. Once it was man who helped the spirits pass on. Two out of four. Spawn back here. Now we're in this graveyard. We're gonna return to the main path here. So now we've done the church and the first house here. We're gonna continue down the path here. We're gonna do this house now. We're gonna enter it. Here we are. And what we're gonna do is that we're gonna go up these stairs here. You can see uh, all the paper flying here. We're gonna go towards this door and the floor will open up. We drop through into a basement and we continue through. Just run through here. More jump scares. Here we are, and we go through. Group hug. Once the Muslim man who helped the spirits pass on, however, he was still. 
and now we spawn over here and here is the last house that we're gonna do here gonna find the entrance here it is and we enter and we enter here we are i was gonna say die stuff so what we're gonna do basically is we're gonna go up here gonna follow the trail of blood basically into this bedroom where we can find this severed arm you know normal thing to find in someone's bedroom we exit the door we go back down down the stairs we continue following the trail of blood down the stairs here what a deal go through the back here and now we see this dude hanging over here oh my arm it's back and that makes this whole contraption fall down and we go up here and once there was the man once there was a man who helped the spirits pass on, however, he was still mortal. 4 out of 4. And now we can see this door in the very back of the whole area. Open. There we are, we spawn outside of it, turn around and enter. Go through the hallway, but at the first room here we're gonna enter and we're gonna grab one old crypt key and then we continue past. All of this basically it's a bit dark but we just go through the end go up the stairs and we drop the key through here and enter the door and here we are rip mile twain a guide and a friend you were warned not to enter this forsaken place but since you have made it thus far I suppose I shall show you the truth You understand now? Then leave and forget the horrors you've witnessed here today. They are safer here. So basically, he used to take care of the spirits, but then he died. So he couldn't take care of them no more. So now we talk to Alum here. I have nothing more to say. Take these. And there we go. Quest completed. A grave mistake. 66,666 experience points and 640 emeralds. Uh, and yeah, that was it for this quest guide. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.